a beautiful morning. Beautiful, nice and cool. The humidity is gone. And we are doing an unboxing today. Oh yeah, guys. Let's walk on over here. Hey, Sophie. What are you doing? What are you doing? Huh? Okay. Oh! What we got over here? Is that a new RC boat? I believe it is. The Thunder Tiger Olympian. Oh yeah, guys. Oh yeah. Are you ready for some speed? Some serious speed? Because this bad boy is going to bring it. 6S capable. 39 inches long. Brushless power. Oh yeah. Let's get it unboxed. Uh, bear with me, I'm going to do this a little different today. This thing's so big, it really don't fit in my little studio down there, so I figure I'd do it out here on the picnic tables. The kids are in school, so I'm solo today. So let's get this thing cracked open. Sit this down for a second. Oh, oh yes, oh yeah, there she is, I love the color, absolutely love the color of it, it kind of reminds me of my uh, Spartan, the, the, the uh, style of it, what's this style called, the uh, V-Haul, is that what they call that, oh let's see, I'm not a boat expert here. Let me look on the box. Yep, V-Haul. The V-Haul design. All right. Let me go ahead and get this uh, this out of here. Wow. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, no. There goes the radio. All right. Besides the boat, you get you get this nice wooden boat stand. Check this thing out, man. That thing's sharp looking actually. It's got Thunder Tiger Olympian uh, etched in the in the wood. Sweet. So we'll put that together to put the boat on. Of course you got your instruction, ma instruction manual and some other stuff in there. I'll have to see what's in there. Alright. And your transmitter. Of course the 2.4 gigahertz. Let me get this out of here. Yeah, same as my uh, Thunder Tiger Bushmaster. All right, let me get this stand put together and I'll put the boat up on the stand for you. All right guys, I got the stand together. Check out this stand, it's just four pieces and it slides right together. It's got the, the logo etched in. It's pretty sweet and it slides right together, no problem. So that'll hold your boat when it's, when you're not, when it's not in use. So there it is guys. Tell me that thing ain't sweet looking. Oh man, I can't wait to rip this thing through some water. <laughs> Check it out. You got these uh, blade protectors on here right now, which I'll have to take off. Just a sharp looking RC boat, guys. Look at this thing. <laughs> Another cool feature I really liked about it was uh, it has this magnetic hatch. There's no uh, clips or nothing to keep it on. It's really strong too, so you ain't got to worry about it coming off. So you just pull up and access all that power. Check it out. All right, guys, check this out. You got your water cooling tubes. You got two of them instead of one. Most, uh, most RCs only have one, but you got two inlets down here that push the water up. And through these tubes, they come in, they go through the ESC, we got 180 amp ESC here. Actually, it looks like one of them goes through the ESC, then back out the side over here. Then the other one comes in, of course, and through the motor, and back out this side, out these little uh, outlet things right here. The water squirts out. So that keeps your ESC and your motor cool. 
because all that power going through there whoo yeah baby oh we got some xt what are they the 80s or the xt 90s got xt 90 connectors on here which is pretty sweet uh what else we got looks like that's a little bit loose we'll stick that down um 180 amp esc as i was saying <laughs> plenty of power uh your motor was i think it was a 2300 kv motor if i'm not mistaken i have to look that back up but you got two battery trays here let me get some light better lighting here yeah you got two battery trays one on this side one on this side so you can either run you can either run two 2s lipos so 4s or you can run two 3s lipos 6s which as you know 4s will give you less power so if you're just starting out with rc boats i would run 4s a bit slower a bit easier to control 6s whoo ho, ho, ho. this sucker's gonna rip i'm telling you that right now she's gonna rip look at this so there's your motor there's your esc there's a slot on this side for your one battery slot on the other side for the other battery two connectors so you plug each battery into each one of those xt90 connectors and there's your prop you got all kinds of durable cnc machined aluminum back here very durable i like the uh design on the back there that looks pretty sweet <laughs> i can't wait to rip this thing man back here you have you have your push rod coming through you see it's got a little walk whoops as you see it's got a little waterproofing uh, thing on there your push rod comes through and then it turns your that's how you turn that, that fin right there it'll turn left and right so anybody new to RC boats that'll help you out uh, but yeah it does come with a plastic prop I'm sure they make metal ones for it but I'm not worried about that shut up back there I'm trying to do an unboxing thank you yeah, guys, I forgot to mention the uh, receiver is actually right down underneath these tubes here, and that is sealed and waterproof in a waterproof case, so you don't even have to worry about that getting, you know, wet or damaged. Because so, water is going to get in here, <coughs> in here, water will get inside your your boat. It happens, uh, and everything's in here is waterproof, so it's not a big deal. Also, your servo here, it is a digital. I forgot to mention that also bad bad rc unboxer um yeah the, the servo is the ds190 digital so um i don't know if that's metal gear not positive it's metal gear um i know my thunder tiger bushmaster came with a metal gear uh, steering servo which was awesome uh so i'm not sure about the 190 here i'll have to check that out yeah guys so your transmitter I've had one of these before with my Thunder Tiger Bushmaster. It's a, it's a sweet little transmitter, honestly. 2.4 gigahertz. Has all the controls you would ever need here. Look at this. It's got everything. It's got your uh, steering reversing, throttle reverse. Uh, you got your trims, all the trims you need, throttle steering. Uh, everything. It's, it's awesome. It's a great little transmitter, so I will have no issues with that. Range is pretty good also. So, yeah, man. All right, guys, in the package, you get your transmitter uh, instruction manual. Disclaimer, you got some, uh, what's this saying? Oh, okay, metal frame upgraded with a new silicone cover. So yeah, they did, okay, it's saying they recently replaced the receiver box cover with a uh, waterproof one. I guess before it wasn't, it's got the silicone cover cool okay there's your regular instruction manual the good old instruction manual tells you a little bit of everything in there will you be quiet locust oh they're driving me nuts sorry guys they weren't doing that when i started and all of a sudden they started chattering okay so you get your uh esc instruction manual there uh, these tubes, I believe they're for the, actually for the um, stand, 
you cut them and you put them underneath there so it cushions the uh, cushions the boat so it sits on like a rubbery kind of uh, thing and in the in the package here you get you actually get some uh, XT 90 connectors to put on your batteries that's awesome that they actually supplied those that's sweet so you can solder them to your batteries if you want to do that um, you get two spare props in there it looks like and you can't beat that you get a tool wrench uh, this looks like you get some uh, rubber gaskets I think or seals for something they're probably for the receiver box I bet in case you in case they wear out I'll have to look into that but yeah man a couple Allen wrenches uh, sweet servo horn so that's awesome they, they supplied the XT90 uh, connectors for the batteries also that's sweet so awesome yeah so again guys I love this this feature here this magnetic uh, hatch if you need nothing you just slap it right on there you just slap it right on there boom and it's on it's tight that's sweet so I don't think that's going to come off in the water, but we'll be finding out because I'm going to be testing this bad boy. So, yeah, look at that. <laughs> oh, wow. She's sweet. Man. I can't wait to get out and run this thing. Woo. Look at that. That is a beautiful RC boat. Yes, it is. Isn't that thing beautiful, monkey? Monkey, isn't that boat beautiful? Say yes. What do you think? Beautiful boat? Yeah, beautiful boat. All right, guys. So I hope you enjoyed that unboxing. And uh, stay tuned, because we're going to be ripping this thing through some some, uh, some water. Uh, me and my daughters will probably take it out. So stay tuned, guys. Until next time. The RC element.